Welcome to the Kero Show Channel. Breathtaking advanced military technologies and inventions, powerful innovative machines capable of changing the course of battles and determining the fate of people on the battlefield. Today we present to you military technologies and inventions that are on a completely different level, revolutionizing the entire defense industry. Enjoy watching. The Pulse Launcher by the Israeli company Elbit Systems is one of the latest variants of a mobile missile system. The main advantage of this system is its high efficiency, which is achieved through a unique guidance system. It uses GPS and gyroscopes to ensure precision targeting and projectile maneuverability during flight. Pulse is capable of launching various types of ammunition at different distances, all from the same position. Each launcher holds two standard containers for different types of weapons. Reloading is done by changing the container with missiles using a conventional truck crane. The installation can be mounted on existing cargo platforms and will operate in various weather conditions. The system can be ready for operation in just a few minutes, making it an ideal choice for sudden attacks. General Dynamics is advancing the protection of combat vehicles to the next level. At the end of last year, Elbit Systems completed testing of the Iron Fist Light Active Protection System for vehicles. The device provides 360-degree coverage around the vehicle on which it is installed. The system consists of special sensors, radar, and interceptor projectiles. If the device detects a threat, it fires projectiles in its direction. The interceptors explode near the threat, neutralizing it away from the vehicle and soldiers. This system can be used in both urban and open terrain environments. Iron Fist Light has been developed in two variants, one for tanks and another for other armored and non-armored vehicles. The device has also been successfully tested by the U.S. Army and may soon be installed on all vehicles, such as the Bradley Infantry Fighting Vehicle. Red Apple is the name of the newest drone from Turkish company Baykar. This is the first jet-powered UAV of this manufacturer. The aircraft incorporates stealth technologies to minimize radar detection. It is designed for launch from aircraft carriers and is intended for missile strikes, suppression of air defense systems, and reconnaissance missions. The carrier of the new aircraft should be the Turkish amphibious assault ship Anadolu, which will be the world's first such hub for UAVs. The Red Apple is planned to be produced in two versions, one being subsonic and the other supersonic. The novelty has impressive characteristics. The flight altitude is 12 kilometers. The radius of action is almost 1,000 kilometers. The payload is 1.5 tons. The maximum speed is 800 kilometers kilometers per hour. It is also planned that in addition to its assault capabilities, the aircraft will also be able to perform the functions of a fighter. We have already mentioned this new, incredibly powerful tank of the U.S. Army in one of our previous videos, and we simply couldn't leave it out of this one. The American Corporation General Dynamics Land Systems has shattered the conventional model of a tank by introducing the new generation Abrams X. The tank operates with the help of artificial intelligence, allowing it to function without a crew. One of the interesting features of the tank is its unmanned turret. This represents a modern and thoughtful approach, because the turret is the most vulnerable part of the tank in battle. Thanks to this innovation, the tank crew is better protected, significantly increasing their chances of survival when hit by enemy shells. The turret is equipped with two circular sights incorporating laser, thermal, and other sensors. The vehicle is equipped with a hybrid engine, allowing for nearly a 50% reduction in fuel consumption. Working on a minesweeper poses a serious danger to the crew, so major countries are looking for ways to automate the process. Special robots are being used for this purpose. The US Navy already uses the Raytheon's AQS-20 system for mine destruction. The system is based on the autonomous vessel MCMUSV developed by the American company Textron Systems. The minesweeper has a radial range of 140 kilometers and can operate autonomously for 20 hours. The boat is equipped with the AQS-20 sonar, which detects and classifies mines. To destroy the detected munitions is used underwater robot Barracuda. The device receives target designations, approaches the mine and detonates it using an onboard charge. Crewless boats like the MCMUSV are designed to serve as carriers for various mine countermeasure equipment. Such drone systems are already equipped on littoral combat ships and auxiliary vessels of the US Navy. The ability of combat trucks to effectively track and engage targets is crucial during military operations. Specifically designed for this purpose, the German company Rheinmetall has developed the futuristic remote-controlled weapon system called Natter. 
The design of this system allows for the installation of machine guns of various sizes. Natter has been specifically designed for use on trucks, with a roof load limit of 105 kilograms. For this purpose, the station has special carbon fiber mounts that reduce the overall weight of the installation and dampen vibrations. Additionally, the turret is equipped with a day and night vision system, enabling the operator to monitor multiple targets simultaneously. The station is capable of tracking targets in both manual and automatic modes. Infantry fighting vehicles are constantly being upgraded to provide the most effective means of defense and attack. An excellent example of this is the next-generation Lynx IFV by German company Rheinmetall. A special feature of the new product is the presence of the Spike anti-tank guided missile system. This system is used to destroy armored vehicles, fortified structures, and enemy personnel. The firing range of the Spike ranges from 200 meters to 4,800 meters. The Spike can also be mounted on ships, helicopters, and is available in a portable variant. As for our IFV, its main weapon is the Lance turret, which, in addition to the Spike, is equipped with a cannon. The turret is manned and designed to minimize its visibility to enemy radars. In order to reduce detection by thermal sensors, the new IFV received an updated exhaust system. The infantry compartment can accommodate 12 soldiers, including three crew members. The main disadvantage of rocket launchers is their high cost and the need to train the crew. The U.S. Air Force solved this problem with the Rapid Dragon palletized missile system. The design of the Rapid Dragon is surprisingly very easy to use. It consists of a standard transport pallet with mounted rail guides. Depending on the requirements, each pallet can accommodate six to nine units of weaponry. When dropping fewer missiles, ballast is placed in empty cells. The assembled system is loaded onto a transport aircraft, such as the C-130J Super Hercules. Upon approaching the designated point, the pallet with the Rapid Dragon is pushed towards the open cargo door. After that, the extractor parachute pulls it overboard. In flight, the main parachute of the system opens, and the rocket launcher hangs on the slings. Rockets fall out of the cells in turn, spreading their wings, starting the engines and rushing towards the program targets. The range of the projectile is 925 kilometers. By the way, you can change the end point of the munitions flight directly during its movement. Recently, the Royal Air Force conducted the final test of a unique reconnaissance drone. But what is its uniqueness, you may ask? The American company Anduril has created a reconnaissance helicopter-type drone Ghost 4. Its distinctive feature is its foldable design. When folded, its length reaches 109 centimeters. The drone can conduct reconnaissance independently and simply notify the operator about the detected objects. Drones can also be combined into a group whose number is unlimited. The Ghost 4 fuselage externally resembles a rifle, but in general, the device is made on the classic helicopter scheme. The length of the drone is 269 centimeters, height and width, 39 centimeters. The most curious thing about the fuselage is that it folds. Thanks to this, the drone can be transported in a carrying case. Furthermore, the drone is electric, enabling flight durations of over 100 minutes. 